Hi, this is Cameron back again with another Vinyl Finds video. This time I'm featuring uh, 22 albums uh, that I picked up in the past week over at a antique store as well as at a, uh, a charity vinyl sale. So it's for our Manitoba Chamber Orchestra. They have a sale once a month of vinyl records that people have donated. I'll get started right away. These are all for $3 each. So first up is Bunny Berrigan who is a jazz trumpeter in the swing era during the 30s and early 40s. I Can't Get Started. This collection came out in 1978 on the Quintessence Jazz Series. Then we have Clifford Brown and Max Roach featuring Sonny Rollins, Richie Powell, and Gut George Morrow, Pure Genius, Volume 1. These are previously unreleased performances from the private collection of Mrs. Clifford Brown. So, uh, Clifford Brown is a jazz trumpeter in the early 50s. This album came out in 1982. Yeah. Next up, some early rock by Chubby Checker, who's best known for uh, the twist, for popularizing the twist. This album is called Limbo Party, and it came out in 1962. It was a number two hit at the time. Then, uh, a rock pop band called Classics 4 with their big hit Spooky featured on this album in 1968. They're best known as being a southern soft rock band and this is their first LP. You can see that it's still in its shrink wrap. Next up, some Exotica by Martin Denny on an album called Spanish Village, which came out in 1965. Then a Brazilian pianist, composer of jazz, Diodato, Love Island, which came out in 1978, so it's sort of his mid-period album. has a gatefold, which I'll, I'll show. Then a Canadian blues band, Downchild Blues Band, also known as Downchild. This album is a collection of their best hits called So Far from 1977. So as I said, these were all three dollars each. Then Dwayne Eddy in shrink wrap called Twangsville from 1964-65. So he's best known for Rebel Rouser and Peter Gunn. So some twang, twangy instrumental music. This album, I, I didn't realize I already had a copy. I'll have to take a look at which one's in better condition. Probably my other one. It's the Five Americans Western Union Sound of Love from 1967. It's on Abnak label. Um, they're a sort of a garagey rock uh, band out of, where are they from? They're from Oklahoma. Then some classic bluegrass by Flat and Scruggs at Carnegie Hall from 1963. They originally called the Foggy Mountain Boys. Lester Flat and Earl Scruggs.
Finally, for this video, so I'm going to continue on the new feet, the new vinyl on a second video just to keep this short. This one is called Dexter Gordon American Classic. He's a jazz saxophonist of the bebop era, and then later on in the sort of a renaissance in the 50s and 60s. This album came out in 1982. It's a promo copy. So stay tuned for part two. In the meantime, please leave your comments at the bottom and please subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it. Have a good day. Bye-bye.